Well, hey folks, this is Seven here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Farm Sim 19. We're here on Richie Villa Course. And yes, I would very much thank you. I'm buying our little farm tractor because I've noticed that our chickens have no food. And that's not good. That is not good at all. So. We want something for the FZ-30. That would be here. Okie dokie. Uh, do we have a Fent sort of color? Dutes, John. Fent natural green. Fent classic. We'll go with that. Thank you. Okay. Now we're also going to need... Oh, they, I don't know why I just did that. What an idiot. Um, yes. Alright, let's try that again. I forgot they actually have their own. Here we are. We want this guy for the 460. That's the one. Yes. And then, of course, we need this guy. And do this guy. And we need a trailer. So, uh, we get that guy to 12,000. 21,000. I think I'm going to. Hmm, what's this little guy? 14. Eee. Yeah, I think we're going to go with this guy. I don't care. Tires are fine. Why? What's the difference? Ooh, those actually I like better. Nice big fat trailbergs. All right, we'll buy this guy. All right. Well, that should do it because as we can see, the chickens need food. The sheep need food. Oh my god, we've got all these animals and nobody's got food. Okay, apparently we don't have cattle yet. Good stuff. Or pigs. So we're safe there, but we've got to get some kit going for the sheep. So, oh, right. Good ideas. I'm going to turn this into something we can actually use. And customize. Twin wheels. No, I want uh, what I usually do. Wide tires and weights. Thank you very much. Engine setup, the 1050. Yep, yep, yep. Yes. Thank you very much. There we are. Now we should be able to turn it around inside the farmyard. <laughs> No, oh, there we go. Yes, look, it turns. And here we are. I got the panoramic one. I think that's just the coolest thing. All the freaking tractors should have that option. You know? Okay.
I just think that's a great combo, that bucket and brush system. Perfect. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Um. No, we don't have pigs yet. I was going to say, maybe I'll save myself a bit of time and grab some pig food. But, guess what? We know has pigs. So. Oh, I have all the uh, animal cheese. We were actually on that farm long enough that I have the uh, sheep, the cows, and the pigs have all hit their cheese. So there you are. The only one I've got, I've got uh, two achievements left to get for FS19. And they both involve digging up the land. Because apparently I like my hired workers and they're, uh, they've got a better rep than I do. So. Oh no, wait a minute. I also have to get the uh, mission ones. But I don't know that I want to do them on this map, to be honest with you. Just because the, the, the field sizes and stuff take you all day to do the darn missions. And I'm not in it for the money, I'm in it for the, well, ye old 50 mission badge, man. Yeah, actually I think it's a ye old 100 mission badge, but there you go. Alright, now I suppose we might as well... <laughs> at least disengage the uh, I don't think we need the wheel lock or dip lock yeah she don't go as fast as the other one let's pop the back off there we go don't need a top on it at the moment it's a beautiful sunny day I would imagine it's uh, early summer by the looks of things but of course that doesn't matter because we're ignoring seasons. Yes. So we'll be able to do things at our own pace as opposed to the games. Which I suppose kind of defeats the game. But there you go. Alright, here we are. Ooh. Yes. Sure. What? Oh. My goodness. <laughs> Here, I think I'm driving the the semi-truck or something, apparently. Alright, now let's have some wheat, please. There we are. That should be enough to fill the chickens. Hello, birds. There you are. Big thanks to Wayne for letting me know that that cedar does not actually take solid fertilizer. It takes liquid. Oops. Pretty solid fence, speaking of solid. <laughs> yeah, I would have uh, otherwise gone out and bought a trailer load of solid fur. And that would not have done the job. I guess looking at the thing, I mean, it's got tanks on it as opposed to... Uh, you know, storage containers. So I suppose, had I paid a little more attention, that would have become a little more obvious. But there's no way I would have noticed before I went out and spent who knows how much on buying solid fur. So, what we're in fact going to do... Oh, right. I don't have that same little functional parking spot anymore. So, I know what we're going to do. in here Lovely. Mm, that might be asking for trouble I should have put it a little whoops a little further over there we go there we go all right next up um, Let's get the sheep dealt with. Now the sheep are going to need water. And that's okay. I need to buy the tanker anyway. Because we're going to have to move some liquid fertilizer. So we're going to need water. And we are going to need bales of grass or something similar. So 
Let's have a look here. Uh, let's start with, uh, I suppose, telehandlers, huh? Because, yeah, I imagine that's the only way I'm going to be able to get that right now. So I don't know if I want to set up a lot of bail stuff if we're not going to do a lot of bail stuff. But we'll see. Twelve hundred bucks for extra wide tires, really? No. Oh, well. Yes. Okay. And back. Da -da 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 -da. There we go. And no, you're not where I want you to. Ooh, Eight thousand liters. That's pretty good. We will be buying one of these, but. Uh, I guess it's under front loaders, and then you just pick which one you want it for, if I remember rightly. Hello, there you are. Customize, and we would like you for a teleloader, please. Bye. Yes. Okay. All right. <laughs> now, all right. Now, well, let's go here. Bells. Customize? Well, I don't think I want to customize them. What I think I want to do is this. Yes. Ah, there you are. Why does this look so offset? I guess it's about right. Hmm. Alright, let's put you at zero. To the right height above the oh, ground. Grab ya. Little lift. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> Except for one small problem. Yeah. Okay, there's the gate. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how they think this works. I guess you're supposed to be able to poke your head out the window. Uh, uh. Oh, that ain't working. God, this is scary. How are we doing at the edge of that bridge? Looks pretty good. Might be a bit close. Oh. Terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. And what did you do to the mirrors on this? What's going on here? Why are my mirrors all froggy? Huh? Why? Are my mirrors so messed up? What is going on here? Mm -hmm. Help icons. What? Money? Euros? No. Dollars. Okay. 
Fast. No, I want this on normal. Weeds are on. Those are off. Fuel usage. Huh. So that's going to be a graphical thing. I guess I've got to do that back from the original ones. So I can't do it from here. Weird. Because that's no good. I need to be able to use my mirrors. I don't want them displaying some fake ball of shoomery. I'll make sure that's straightened out for next time. Bad enough I can't see anything out the windshield. I've helped to have mirrors. <laughs> Come on, baby. Go, go, go. Lavender, eh? Needs lime? Well, it's a little late to be telling me that. Yeah, I'll just be a sec. Appreciate your patience. If you honk your horn, I'm going to walk over there and break your window. And some goats. Okay. There we go. Now, we are going to buy a few more fields, of course. As we go along here. It might be interesting to see what's in them. And we also could have simply bought mowing equipment, which we will do. Okay. Whoop. Thought I was going to make that one clean. Not quite. There we go, and we're off. We can find ourselves some chickens. Ah, uh, sheep. <laughs> Here, chickens, look what I brought you to eat. Buck, 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 buck. <laughs> can you say bad chicken? Alright, whoops. I think we're in the grass now, aren't we? Alright, here we go. Hello there, sheeps. Lovely to see ya. Good morning, dear. Alright, here we go. Um, that is their food. Yeah, it is. There we are. Cool, huh? Let's get a little better grip on them. Okay. All right. Happy, happy. Joy, joy. There's that task done. Now let's go get ourselves a tanker. But I want to drop a placeable first. Well, a couple actually. So I want to put down a... Oh, no, I don't think we need water storage, do we? That puddle never did freeze over and we're not running seasons, so no, we won't need that. I'm going to put a little shed down by the animals there at some point for the uh, telehandler and the uh, other cow me now equipment. Erd. There we go. In you get. Okay. Now we need ourselves a truck. What we need? 
a tanker. So, trucks. Blah, blah. And what do we got here? Well, I know we've got this one that comes on the Ricciville site, but I find these a little awkward to get around the farmyard. I much prefer the uh, European versions. How much is that? 152k. Well, there you go. These are even cheaper. Um, I'm going to go with this guy. It's only a 4 instead of a 6, but yeah, I think we're still going to like it. Uh... <clears throat> And the tank air. Do do. What are you under trailers? Possibly. We here we are. The Ricciville tanker. Yes, indeed. Carries everything. Customize. Okay. Main color blue. I don't think so. Design. Yeah, that's the one we want, and our color is going to be, again, we'll go with the cloth green, and buy. Yes. Now, what we need not in there. Um, I think it's here. Storage, storage, storage. Uh, diesel storage. I didn't miss it then, did I? No. No, 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 Liquid fertilizers. 20k? I don't remember it being that much. <laughs> All right, here we go. I don't know why I get so much terrain deformation failure notices here, considering I've got the uh, the bit of mod on that I'm supposed to have on. There we go. Let's drop it there. Okay. Blah, blah. Let's see if we can find our new truck, shall we? Whoops. <laughs> Boob. Thank you. Now... We need this. Yes. Okay, there they are. Oh man, that's going to take forever. Okay. Now we just sit here and keep hitting the R button until uh, we get most of these filmed, I guess. <coughs> Which is what I meant about this wasn't going to be nearly as convenient. I told uh, Wayne that. He goes, oh, by the way, it takes liquid fertilizer. Well, <laughs> that's why it's not as convenient. 
I could have simply gone to the uh, place that dumps dry fruit and uh, loaded it up like grain. And it's incredibly quick. But that's okay. We'll suck this up and take it and dump it where it belongs. And that'll be just fine. Just fine indeed. Hmm. Yeah, so my poor old neighbor I've mentioned a few times, the elderly lady that lives a couple doors over. She's, well, I guess 83 this year. Got a phone call a couple of days ago from her in the evening, and she was phoning from the hospital. She broke her hip. Guess where? In the hospital. Yeah. Went for an appointment to uh, do something else, and was about to leave the hospital. And she's having an issue with one of her legs, and it gave out, and down she went. And yeah, she's now <laughs> over in Campbell River having surgery. Uh, it's just, I don't know, poor old thing. I mean, good lord. So I've been going over and feeding her kitty, Mr. Bill. He was certainly... Glad to see me this morning. I mean, you know, he's uh, used to having company there most of the time because she also has a little dog named Happy. Well, uh, a friend of hers is looking after Happy. You know, it's one thing to leave a kitty by itself in the house. A little dog, no, nah, it just doesn't work. Because they have to be taken out. Kitties, you just got to clean their litter box. So, yeah, not only does it not have its owner there, the poor kitty, but uh, it doesn't have its little dog companion either. So, I went over this morning, and as soon as I opened the door, he just kind of booking. <laughs> and then kind of stops and looks and go, whoa, you're not what I expected. Which was rather unusual, considering he was exactly what I had expected. <laughs> Man, that's just not very much, you know. I know this is taking a little bit of time, and I do apologize, guys, but that's basically going to fill that cedar like once, maybe twice. Um, hmm. Yeah, let's... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... That'll give us another, whatever, 20,000, I guess. It sure picks them out of strange spots. Yeah, you can actually hear it filling. Yeah, it's pretty funny. Uh, I don't have realistic beacons on either. I've turned the graphics down a little bit. As you'll notice, I'm getting a pretty constant 60 FPS, which I thought would be a, a little bit better than trying to have, you know, above average graphics. I mean, YouTube is going to make it look like crud anyway, so. What to do? It's not like I've turned things down to low. I've just turned some of the more resource-hungry bits off. Or down, at least not off, certainly. Nothing is turned off. I would hope with an 8-gig video card I wouldn't have to turn things off just to run farm sim. I don't know. I don't know. I've always found this to actually be, uh, all things considered, a fairly taxing game to run you know but I've always just put it off to you know 
there is so darn much going on in this thing that yeah no wonder you know if you had to render 50,000 blades of grass and right beside it 60,000 blades of wheat and you know and then there's 200 bales in the field there and there's six bales of cotton there and 600 cows and you know yeah I can understand it might be a bit tough all right here we go last one There we are, four nine 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 nine. Perfect amount. It's like fifty thousand with a rip-off tax. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Don't try this at home, kids. <laughs> oh, I'll bet that guy is now changing his mind about where he was going because he needs to go home first and do a wee change of the undies. Yes, indeed. Wow. <laughs> sorry, fella. Sorry, sorry. Now, are the mirrors on this all blurry and weird? Yes, they are. Okay, so it's something I've done in the graphics. I apologize. That will not do. In fact, yeah, look at that. Well, I guess that's about standard interior. But no, those those mirrors are butchered beyond belief. Now, I don't think I can load directly into this cedar, so... That was the reason I put this thing up. In what is probably the most awkward place in the universe. Okay, which side is innie and which side is outy? You are innie. Okay, perfect. That's not too bad. It's not to say I'll ever be able to get the cedar anywhere near this thing, but hey. Come on, get back there. That's the ticket. Yeah, that might not have been the best place to put that, eh? I think we'll be alright. As I said, I've got some landscaping to do. There, oh, that's already empty. What you wait for, man? Nothing. Alright. Now, the other thing we must do is go all the way over here and get our last shore of the day. We do still need to bring water to our ship, so. Now that we have the wherewithal to do that, quick super rinse of the tank, and we'll fill her with some water. See, now that's a fill rate. <laughs> We don't need to fill this all the way. There's no way the sheep are going to drink more than 40,000 liters of water on their first day. So, we'll get this dropped off and then I think we'll call her a start. <laughs> I forgot what I was doing there for a moment. Hello, the sheep. Here you go. My fine little woolly crunchies. So how many sheep do we have anyway? Hmm? What does this mean? Three. Oh, I see. I have three white sheep, three brown sheep, three black and white sheep. So I've got a dozen sheep. Is this what you're telling me? And I've got ten... 20, 30 chickens. Well, 29 chickens and a rooster. Okay. So, all in all, not a lot, hey? Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We don't need a lot to start with. 
But that kind of segues into my next bit, and that is uh, we've already done a lot today. So I think we're going to call the episode there. Hope everybody enjoyed. And until next time, well, take care of each other, folks. I'm going to uh, park this puppy up over here. All right, and ciao for now.